it's quarter to ten. And I'm just having my... Did you see that? <laughs> I fogged up my glasses. I'm just having my first coffee. I'm just having my coffee. I'm really slow starting this morning. I didn't even see my son online. So he's, you know, got up and gone to work. I've made my coffee extra hot. Tired of lukewarm coffee. Mm -mm -mm. It's, it's, it's sort of okay outside. It's one degree and it's got these fog signs. It's one degree and foggy out there. I thought it was supposed to be raining. Mm. The roads are wet, so I don't know if that's wet from the fog or wet from, from rain, but anyway, it's only one degree. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Should I wait to go for a random walk? Or should I wait for when it gets possibly warmer? Or do I risk actual rain then and then I won't be able to go for a walk? Don't know. The reason I'm in such a good mood? We went to see. <clears throat> Sherlock Holmes last night. But first, we went to the mall. We got our tickets. <clears throat> and uh, then we walked around the mall searching for, we went early, so that we could um, <clears throat> look for stuff for my parents and other stuff. And while we were walking around, I decided well, my husband and I, we both decided to, there's no pleasing my parents. There is no pleasing them, no matter what we get them. They're not going to be happy with it. They're going to say something about it. So, forget that. We got them some dark chocolate. Candies. And... Just random sweet stuff. Because that's not much. But, you know, can't get them books because my dad reads historical romance type fiction that he gets from my sister. And they just, you know, he picks it up at garage sale, she picks it up wherever from friends and they just trade and go back and forth. So there's no giving me anything to read. My mother doesn't do that. She is a newspaper or magazine reader and there's no giving her anything. So anyway, just a little something so that they do get something that one that matches our new dishes set. So we found a really nice soup bowl to match. So that's great for Christmas Eve. So parents done, bowl found, ta-da! And then there was the movie. Fantastic! It was really enjoyable. Robert Downey Jr., of course. There's no, you know, he's just good and he, he does a good job. But he was really fun for this Holmes. 
I didn't find him quite as much fun. Well, he was just as good. I just liked it better. I fell asleep during the last Holmes. Every time I watched it, I fell asleep. I don't know why. I really don't. But this time, I did not. I stayed awake through the whole thing, even though it was the same, you know. Why do I change colors? sepia tone, you know, I don't know, somehow it put me to sleep last time, and all the reruns put me to sleep, so something about the movie, those kids, um, put me to sleep, this one did not, of course, you know, critics will say that it's, it's absolutely not authentic to, to, um, thank you, um, to Sherlock Holmes, but, whatever. I thought it was better than the last one because they did incorporate more of Sherlock Holmes. Um, there was more talk. There was more uh, explanation of what Holmes' thought process is. There was more you know, all that stuff. And uh, they brought in his uh, Sherlock Holmes' brother, Mycroft, played by Stephen Fry. <laughs> what a riot. What a riot. So, between uh, Robert Downey Jr. and Jude Law as Watson and Stephen Fry as Mycroft. And uh, who played? Who played? I forget. I forget. I forget. Uh, Jared Harris as uh, Professor Moriarty. Um, they were all really cool. And um, and um, what's her name? No, 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 no. Kelly Riley as um, Watson's wife. Everyone was really good. Stephen Rock Fry's <laughs> nude scene. He's such a riot. And, and Robert Downey Jr. I love him so well acted, well produced, well well directed. Really good movie. I enjoyed it. I believe all the Sherlock Holmes part there. There it goes. My color goes again. Um, were there? Everything was there. So, if you want a movie to go see over the holidays, go see Sherlock Holmes. Next one on my list, The Girl with the Dragon, Dragon Tattoo. Maybe Mission Impossible, but we never go see Mission Impossible in the movies, in the cinemas, so we'll probably go see The Girl with the Dragon Tattoo. That's it. Students never say that. Don't just say at the end, that's it. That's all. But I am going to. Maybe I'll go out and go for a walk. It's two walks we did yesterday. Well, yesterday and the day before, so I'm thinking maybe while the weather is relatively warm, I should get out there. Started doing more decorating because it's getting close. But you can't see that because. The glass ornaments I had over there, I moved to over here, and I put different ornaments up. Hi, Julia. Julia's watching me there from the... <laughs> you can't see anything because she is dark. The TV is dark, and she's sitting up against the TV. Uh, maybe that's her. You think that's her? Mm -hmm. No, that's just a reflection in the... Anyway, off I go, maybe to a walk.